provide short-term care needed to ensure a long-term future for dogs who are about to be euthanized. This weekend, the organization is holding a fundraiser. And St. Augustine's United Help a Hound Charity Golf Tournament is going to be on Saturday. So joining me now, we have Lindsay Kelly, Alyssa Kelly. Uh, we also have um, Carrie Gaynor, who is from St. Augustine United. And then we cannot forget... Miss Rosie, or she has like all kinds of names, right? Yep. Yes. Yeah, better known as Mama Rose. And Mama yes. Rose. Okay. So, you know, I, I want to, um, maybe this will jog your brain for the folks that are watching at home because uh, Ashley Mitchum, um, she, we kind of chronicled her story with her dog Chance and, and you guys have really helped her along the way with, with this dog. Yeah, absolutely. We, um, we love it when people fall in love with hounds who have mm -hmm. no experience with hounds. And that, that's what happened with <laughs> Ashley. Um, she fell in love with his big ears and, and his howl. And, um, and he got a lot of exposure and he did a lot of good, really. He, he shared uh, his story with so many people that had no idea how hounds can be treated. And this is a great, I mean, I mean this is just uh, honestly a great example. Because when that dog showed up, I mean, he really was on death's door. Yeah. Maybe not to be euthanized. But, I mean, it's a miracle that he survived. Mm -hmm. And those are the types of animals that you're placing, the ones who are either, either going to be very expensive to fix mm -hmm. or the ones that, you know, might be considered risky to have. Right. So t tell me a little bit about how the costs for doing that. Um, costs can range. It's a big range. We can, we can take in a, you know, quote-unquote healthy dog, and they can cost us, you know, $350 to spay and to vaccinate and to deworm and just the normal things for dogs that come out of shelters. Or you can have a dog like Rose or Chance even who are heartworm positive. Um, that can range us close to $1,000. So money kind of flies out the door when we bring dogs in. Okay, so I know the two of you are in the dog saving business. You just want to, I mean, that you want to do your thing, and, but it requires raising money. So you yes. came up with this golf tournament idea, and this is where Carrie comes in, because they have a great charity in St. Augustine that helps other charities, which I think is so wonderful. So you guys stepped in, and, and, and where, where did you take it from there? Uh, I had met Lindsay and Alyssa. They came door to door with a lost dog in my neighborhood, and that was <laughs> two years ago. Yeah. So uh, three friends and I started St. Augustine United last year, and uh, we did a 5K, and we said, we just want to help. We love St. Augustine. We love our community. We, we just want to help other people know where they can go to help charities. And we picked Swamp Haven this year, and we have the golf outing this Saturday at uh, Royal St. Augustine Golf and Country Club. 8.30 a.m., Route 16, please. There's still, <laughs> there's still spots. Come well, on out. And I think the thing is, is you know, I, I'm a huge animal lover, um, but, you know, we have a three-year-old, so taking in, in one of these dogs, it, I mean, it would definitely, I was thinking about this this morning, I would love to do it, but with a kid, you just never, you, I mean, you never know. So the way to, to give back and help is to attend the golf tournament sure. and make the donation yes. and help that way to ensure that, you know, the dogs are still taken care of. Sure, yes. Um, so how many dogs right now are, are, are do, you, do you guys have? And, and the capacity, though, is probably so much more than what you currently have. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, we have 19 dogs in the rescue currently, um, and we're foster home based. We don't have a facility, um, so we we're kind of um, we are as good as our fosters are, pretty much. Yep. And it takes money to help them yeah, foster yes, the dogs. Yes, All right. Yes. So, Help a Hound Open Charity Golf Tournament is once again, as we mentioned, it is going to be um, at Royal St. Augustine Saturday, April 29th, 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. Shotgun start at 8:30. You can go to news4jacks.com's the morning show page. Get more information. Again, they still have foursomes available, or you can just make a donation. Uh, and, and we'll give you more information um, there on the website about how you can link to do that as well. All right, we'll be right back.